Hi everyone. So right now I'm filming with the Fuji X-H1. Now using 4K, it crops the video a little bit. So the cropping factor is like 1.19. So I have to be a little bit more farther. But I still have it at 1 48th of a second. F 4.5. Exposure compensation now is at 2 thirds, plus 2 thirds. And the ISO is at 200. So I'm going to move around. See if it's detecting my face. It is. Moving over here. And I don't see any focus hunting right there. I'm going to get a little bit closer. Seems like it's focusing on me. I'll go a little bit farther. It's still, face detection still has me. Don't see too much or any focus hunting. Um, in terms of exp <laughs> exposure, uh, I'm a little hot right here. Uh, this is blown out. Um, I'm not using an ND filter in this case. I wanted to see how it looks. I'm using a Turno. Uh, it's on boost. It's a 16 millimeter f1.4. And so far, it's been working quite well. <laughs> Not too bad actually. So usually the Fuji cameras that I've used like the uh, X-T2, X-T1, X100S, T and F and even the X-E3 they all have issues. Especially when the tree leaves start to move it really is trying to really do too much. But this camera seems to have nailed the focus detection. I'm not sure why. Maybe it has more phase um, detection type uh, pixels or maybe they're cranking the CPU so that it can do a better job. Either case, this is way better than the XE3s in terms of, of face recognition. Now the AFC custom mode and sensitivity is at zero. So if I go like this or something, it's not going to go off focus too fast, right? Even if I go back, I can see it's detecting my face, and it's going to be very interesting to see if it keeps focus on me. Now, of course, if I move my head a little bit or wobble my head, it's probably going to try to like focus uh, a little bit. I do see. I did see right here somewhere a little focus hunting, but this is really workable. Um, right now I'm using the small HD, so you can you probably see my eyes move up a little bit. And I also am using the uh, video micro. So everything here looks great. I am really impressed. So this is the 4K version. I also did a 1080p version. Go ahead and check that one out. Bye-bye.